So we have complete the first step in the solution, which is 8 equals n divided by 3. So we know that n is the unknown in this equation, and we want to get n by itself. And right now, we have this divided by 3 attached to the n over here. So what we need to do is get this 3 over here. So what we would do is by moving it over, since we have the divide by here, we need to use the opposite sign. And the opposite sign of division is multiplication. So that would mean in order to get 8 over to the other side, we would need to multiply it by 3. So we'd have 8 times 3 over here which would equal n. And we could simplify that by multiplying this out. So 24 is equal to n.